Woman claiming to be a friend of running back Joseph Randall says she wants to set the record straight. She says she was there this week when the Wichita native was arrested. Cake Step Ferris with her story. This is new at six. Deb. Yeah, guys, Amanda Edwards posted a YouTube video today online saying she was with Randall when he was accused of domestic violence. She's now asking the public not to give up on him. My name is Amanda Edwards, and I'm doing this video as a favor because I wasn't going to say anything at all. This woman claims that she was with Joseph Randall at 3 o'clock Tuesday morning at the Waterwalk Hotel in Wichita. Police were called there to investigate a domestic disturbance with a gun. There was no gun. I mean, I don't know where the gun even came into the picture, but there was no gun. But a protection from abuse order filed by Randall's ex-girlfriend and mother of his son tells a different story. She was also at the hotel that morning and claims Randall waved a gun at her friend and shattered a car window, the glass falling onto Randall's son. Joseph in turn came downstairs and punched my window out. Mind you, he had no idea that his son was in the car because my windows were tinted. Randall was a standout football player at Southeast High School and is now a running back for the Dallas Cowboys. When officers arrived at the hotel Tuesday morning, they didn't find enough evidence to arrest Randall for domestic violence. Edwards admits in the video she hasn't talked to police and that she doesn't plan to. I'm just trying to get the truth out there. Um, don't quit on him yet. He's a, he's a, he's a good guy. Wichita police dropped a misdemeanor drug possession charge against Randall, but say this investigation is not over and the charge can be refiled along with other charges in the future. And we tried contacting Randall for comment, but he has not gotten back to us.